Now, I didn't do two tours of duty in Iraq just to come home to eat a bunch of farts. Or queefs. Fanny biscuits. Spirit of Dookie Smellington's cheese flap mushroom doo-doo stew. Air attack of bean bombers. Crack rattlers. Pants blasting juice poofs. Thanks so much for the famous anus cookies. Communion After Dark.
so much to say You think you set me free When you said stay up with me to communion after dark it is the week of october 16th i'm mouse and we have paradise and winters i'm the first set today um but you probably guessed that from listening to it um that was my industrial pop synth pop set uh so the last song we heard was brand new ashbury heights this is their Halloween song. They, every Halloween, they put out something spooky. Um, Ashbury Heights is based out of Sweden. This is a song called Ghosts Electric. Uh, it's just a single that you can get on their band camp. It's, uh, it's like Chipmunk Industrial. Oh, great. Uh, yeah, that's a great way to describe it. Uh, and the sixth track in my set was by Johan Bekström, also out of Sweden. Uh, Mark, do you know this guy? Do you yeah, he's in that band. Um, man, what is the band called? Uh, is it Daily Planet? Yeah. Yes. Okay. Yeah, he's in Daily yeah. Planet. Mm -hmm. So um, th this was the song called Forever in Here. It is going to be on an upcoming album called Here, uh, an EP. And um, all we know is that it's due in autumn. The song itself is available on um, Progress Productions, and you can purchase it on Bandcamp. But when yeah. I heard it, I was like, oh my gosh, is this elegant machinery? Like, this is definitely <laughs> somebody from Sweden. Yeah, he makes, yeah, no, his, yeah, it's very distinct synth pop sounding music. Yeah, it's good. I bought that uh, single as well while, 
recently on uh, I think Bandcamp or wherever. And then the fifth track in my set is by Gunship out of the UK. Um, this Gunship album was my album of the month for last month. Uh, this is the song Empress of the Damned featuring Lights and Tim Capello. Oh, wow. Uh, our saxophone dude. And uh, this is from yeah. the album Unicorn. That you can get on Horsey in the Hedge. Tim! Tim! From Lost Boys. Yeah, yeah. He's still uh, he's still doing his thing. Still belting um, it out. So there is a link. The link that I provided... Um, make sure to look at our playlist for the link. Um, the link that I provided is a digital deluxe version of the album. And if you buy it from there, you get their secret song, which is mm. a cover of Send Me an Angel. Awesome. But I didn't play Send Me an Angel because I am a snob about covers and it has to be better than the original. And this sounds exactly like the original. Oh. To me. So I didn't play the cover, but it's good. Just go listen to it. All right. The fourth song in Mouse's set is IMX out of the UK. And that was the song Thanatos. And that is the Damn the Witch Siren mix. And that is on the Thanatos remixes. And not sure what label they're on. I'm not sure what label either. I, are, are they self-released? Is IMX self-released? I'm, um, I'm not 100% sure. sure they have what a lot of big anymore. artists now that are releasing stuff off label now. So I don't. IMX has usually been on some type of label, but I don't know what he's doing right now. I don't know which label. Um, we'll have to fall. research that. Unfall. Might be his uh, own label that he's on now. Might be. Yeah. yeah. Okay. All right. Well, new IMX mixes. That's from, I'm assuming those are mixes from the last album, if I'm not he, mistaken. Yeah. The most he's recent a, album. Yes. Um, I think the album was called Fault Lines. Right. It and, was. Um, and then there's individual singles that are coming out. It doesn't seem to be on like one remix album. Mm. Um, but they're just individual single remixes that you can get. All right. <laughs> Sorry. Mouse's third song in our set was by Deadlights. They're back. Deadlights is um, out of the UK and uh, Germany, I believe. Uh, there's two members in the band. We've had we had them on the show a while back. Last yeah. year, I believe. And no, um, they have a brand year. new... Oh, it might have been two years ago. You got to add three years <laughs> to everything. Yeah. But they have a brand new album out. Um, it is finally out. It's called Glitter Spit. It's on Dark Tunes Music Group. Um, the song she played was The Electric Ocean off the brand new album. So very exciting. This is Dark Tunes. I'm um, sorry. Dark Lights. Dark Lights. Dead, Dead Lights. Light. You can do it. You can dark do it. Dark Tunes. Dark. Dead Lights. Um, first uh, full length release, I believe, if I'm not mistaken, on Dark Tunes. Or is there a second? I think it's their first full length. I mean, I know they released many singles on Dark Tunes, but I want to say this might be their first full album on that label. So, I don't know. But anyways, it's good. And uh, check it out. They're a fantastic band. If yeah. you've heard their music before, you'll know that. So if I love you the name of that album. We'll find them. I love yeah, it, some... too. I know. Yeah, that's... Yeah, later. <laughs> that's cool. Uh, and then the second song in my set was brand new unit code machine there is a full album out now uh the song i played was called surface and uh the album is called critical fault you can get this on cop international uh unit code machine is out of the u.s and they just played here recently um this album is phenomenal it's awesome. really really great stuff from top to bottom i think it might be my pick of the month for this month that's awesome yeah Eric puts out good stuff. I'm glad to see he's uh, he's on cop now. Yeah, he's on cop. And I started out with Wingtips uh, out of the U.S. And this was the song called Repetitive, the Danny Blue remix. And this you can actually get on a remix album simply called Remixes. And um, there's a lot of great remixes on there. And uh, you can get it on Artifact Records. I actually couldn't decide which remix to play. I changed it three different times. Uh, I almost played the Hex Heart one, which is really good. Yeah, there's Hex uh, Heart. I think there's a Twin Tribe. There's one Traitors. On there. Traitors. There's yeah. uh, Chris um, Baja. But his wow. is really long. 
Like, so if you want a six and a half. Some good stuff on there. Tip song. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Pretty good. So. so that was it. That was my industrial synth pop set. Yeah, Thank I like that. Mouse. Good stuff, Thank man. Thank you. I really loved my set. You know, yeah, sometimes no. you just, you put it together and you're listening to it and you're just like, this is fucking fun. Yeah, mm -hmm. no, that is a good set. I agree. All right. Well, Mouse, we're going to do a shot of the week now. Since yeah, you're back with us, it's shot of the week yeah. time. Yeah. All right, everybody. Shot of the week time. I have tequila that my husband says tastes like caramel, but it doesn't smell like caramel to me. How so could tequila I'm taste probably like gonna die. <laughs> what do you got, when, uh, Miles? I mean, this is Kool-Aid sake. Nice. I like that one. My and own tequila, Kool Aid sake, and then I have, I have chocolate banana. All right, ready? All right. Cheers. 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 Oh, drink, you drink. I like my cup is dirty again. Nope. Oh. Woo! You got some left over? There you go. Oh, winter's like that tequila. I am not a fan of tequila. Oh my god! <laughs> Oh my god. That would have been hilarious. <laughs> you gotta, you gotta up chuck you on almost the show. had an accident on the show. Wouldn't that have been funny? I am not a fan of tequila. It was like it was like tequila, but then it has an aftertaste <laughs> of vanilla and caramel. And that just should never that should never be a thing. But no, tequila Mike needs to said be that like he bought it for lemon like, lime based. Yeah, he said he bought it for sweet watermelon. Oh, oh you guys, I can't. Something. You need to put something in your mouth to get that taste out. I am. Girl. All right. Pineapple kombucha. All right. So, uh, yeah, Gold is um, Gold's doing much better. He will be back with us in a couple of weeks. We're looking forward to having him back um, mm -hmm. a few weeks down the road. Next week, though, we got... Um, Oh man, what I can't. This yeah. week we have. We got Mouse this week, but Mouse, Mouse is a old school. Damn. Oh, Emma Vot is coming next week. Electronic Emma. body memes. Hmm? Emma. Emma. Emma body yes. memes. Yes, yes. She'll be guest uh, filling in next week. Gold will be back, though, I think either the week after that or two weeks after that. I'm not sure, but he'll be I back. I think it's soon. two weeks after that. So. Thanks, Mouse, for coming again. We love having you on, and I'm happy you're still uh, here every month at least. So, uh, good set too. I enjoyed your set, and uh, thank you to everybody who uh, continues to listen to the show. Go to uh, if you get a chance when you go to our YouTube comment on the show. And by the way, YouTube now is going up every Tuesday at around seven or eight p.m. Eastern Standard Time. So, if you're looking for it, we used to put it up in the morning. That has changed. It now goes up Tuesday evening. So if you want to watch our Zoom video, which is the only, YouTube is our only platform where you can actually see where we're recording the talking parts and see our actual pretty faces, uh, then you and have to pretty go drinks. To, and our pretty drinks. Yes, or I'm, I, I still have my drinks all every every week. My bed pants? Uh, well, Winters is wearing bed pants and, and she needs to start drinking on so the show. Uh, you need you need like a glass of your husband needs to make you a mixed drink with tequila as well. I don't, think, I don't think she's it's gonna just, touch tequila again for a while. Yeah, it's just literally what's I'm gonna have house. to start I, buying I'm winters like drinks for her house. Um anyway, so yeah. You can see us every uh, every goes up every Tuesday, eight PM. Comment, uh like the show. If you go to Mixcloud and you listen, because that goes up every Monday, please comment as well and like the show. We appreciate it. All right. Um, Winter is coming up next. For more music. Uh, what are you starting back. off with, Winters? Do you want to tell everybody? I'm playing Alien Vampires again. I really like this album. This is good. All right. Come back.
Dagens stjärna entrar himmelens golv Och nattens maror spelar allt mindre roll En själ av stål befriar oss från krav En säker visning fram till min grav Yeah
back. This is Winters. You just heard my set. Um, that last track that you heard is brand new IO. And this is the song Televised Lies that is on the brand new album Dreaming that came out on Distortion Productions. I love this band. I really like this album as well. And I like my set too. <laughs> yeah, good. Um, that's awesome. And before that is Kim Lunner out of Norway. Uh, I've played Kim Lunner numerous times before because it's really good synth pop. Um, and this is the song I Miss You So. And this is the I Miss You So single. And Kim Lunner is on Town and Towers Records, which I believe is out of Sweden. And before that, you heard brand new Orchard Task. Uh, and this is the single Ignite Me. Um, that is self-released. Orchard Task will be at New World Brewery uh, this Friday with Dead Cool and Fall Shock. I would not miss that show if I were you. So. All right. And I'm DJing now. All right. The fourth track in Winter Set was by Supernova1006 out of Russia. They have a brand new album out called Chains. Um, the song she played was Ghost Runner. That is on Negative Gain as well. Wow, Negative Gain is pumping out the music as of late, so pretty cool. This is good. Um, some of the stuff. Uh, stuff. Yeah, no, it's good. I, I mean, I listen Supernova, to... Supernova, yeah, they, they, they've always kind of been all over the place. They started out with more of a post-punk feel, and then it got more electronic, more electronic, and now it's just like a perfect blend of both, I feel. Cool, in my opinion. <laughs> Yeah, it stood out. That was one of the songs I heard in your set last week that you played that I thought stood out. So it's pretty cool. And the third song in winter set was a band called Elect out of Sweden. And uh, this was a song called Dimma, D-I-M-M-A. And it's a single, self-released, but you can get it on Bandcamp. This is really good female fronted synth pop, EBM. And I really like this track. Swedish music might Swedish. just be the best. I know, right? Send me to Sweden. <laughs> I need to go to Sweden, guys. Let's just go. Let's, Let's just, just go. go. We'll crash at Ashbury Heights house. I just basically yeah, picture all awesome. these people just singing some pop everywhere with their beautiful voices. <laughs> and second song <laughs> of my set is Iman out of Sweden as well. Um, and this is Machines that was remixed by Ultrasun. This is the Recon Mix um, album, which is um, different remixes by uh, different artists. And she is on Icons Creating Evil Art. I love the name of that label. Um, Iman is very, very um, dance oriented, good boom boom and then obviously you probably heard this song and you know that distinct sound of ultrasound cool and, and the, the fourth band the fourth band that we've played from sweden on the show today i know <laughs> yeah it's a lot a lot of sweden i'm gonna get a shirt that says i heart sweden, sweden. <laughs> i heart sweden music i heart sweden music we'll get one from mark that says fantastic I heart, on the back I heart swedish meatballs that's yeah. what I need. Oh, yeah. Yeah. And I started everything off with Alien Vampires out of Italy. Um, and that's the song My End. And that is on the Return Me to Hell album that came out on Alpha Matrix. But that mm -hmm. new Alien Vampires album is so far my favorite for this month. And so you far. have to get the uncensored one so you can get the naked girls on the cover. <laughs> That's the one you want. Are they completely naked or did they just showing your boobs? It's like side boob and butt and stuff. It's approved. Mm -hmm. All, right. All right. So um, I wanted to thank everybody who came out to Absolution Fest 2023. Uh, we Yay! didn't really talk about that much, but that was a um, fantastic turnout this year. Uh, it was actually our most successful one we've had. So, yeah, it was great. The bands were fantastic. Thank you, everybody, 100% who attended. I really appreciate it all the support and uh, love and i hope more of you will come back next year it was uh yes yeah, fun i had a really good time um 
just that uh, was fantastic. All the bands were great. I thought it was just a great time all around. Uh, so thank you uh, to everybody who attended, who helped out. I mean, can't can't thank everybody enough. And um, we also have a few shows left for Community After Dark. We're almost done for this year, which is not a bad thing necessarily because there's been some great shows this year. But I have a few left. I have um, one this coming Friday, which we talked about, which was October 20th. That's De- uh, Fall Shock, first Yay. time in America. Fall De- Shock is from Italy. Um, and um, they're playing. He's playing with Dead Cool, which are they're out of North Carolina, and um, Ultra Tusk, as uh, Winters already announced, who's out of uh, Tampa, St. Petersburg, Florida, which is local. So there should be a fantastic show this coming Friday at New World. Following Saturday at New World, it's a spooky show with Boot Blacks, Last Grasp, and Rux Vendetta. That is going to be a fantastic lineup of bands. Boot Blacks is is playing a sh- their only. Well, they're on a tour, but they are playing a solo show for us here in Tampa. And we're really excited about that. They'll also be at New World. It's going to be a great lineup. Last Grass just played Absolution Fest. Yay. Um, and Rux down. Vendetta is fantastic live. You haven't seen them. Mm, they Definitely really need to see them. They're great. So it's going to be a really good show. And then November 3rd, we have another fantastic show. XTR Human, who played um, in uh, Tampa at Absolution Fest 2022 two years ago um will be headlining at new world on november 3rd with eon rings supporting and uh dj fx that'll be the first time we've ever used dj fx so it's gonna be a good time and extra, extra human is super excited to come back to tampa oh. um so let's give that warm welcome I'm super excited for them coming back to Tampa as well. So three shows coming up at uh, New World, and then we're basically done. We do have some shows in December, which we can talk about as it gets a little closer. Not many. Uh, there's like one, I believe. <laughs> so we're pretty much done after November. Uh, but yeah, come out to support those shows, and they're all at New World starting this coming Friday, October 20th. Uh, and so if yeah. you're in South Florida... Yep. And you can't make it all the way to Tampa, understandable. Um, Fall Shock and Dead Cool will be doing Militia down in Miami. And I will be guest DJing with uh, DJ Dino for that nice. as well on a yeah. Saturday. And DJ Dino was just at Absolution. I know. I love Dino. You did a good job. <laughs> all right. Um, I am next. We're going to come back with more music. So uh, don't go away. And we'll see you soon. This is Community After Dark Radio, and you are listening to DJ Paradise. Let our bodies move forever Let the light 
lights shine around you as it moves to the echoes. Let the sounds carry you. Let music live forever.
After dark, that was the third set of our show. We're not done yet. We have one more song coming up, so don't go anywhere. Last track you heard was by Apnoe. Um, Apnoe is a artist out of Russia. Um, the new track that is out by Apnoe is called Any Way Death. It's a digital single. Picked up through Dark Tunes Music Group. Definitely, I've always enjoyed uh, so far what I've heard from um, this artist. So if you uh, like uh, synth pop, uh, check out this uh, release and the release prior. The fifth track in my set was by another great band called White Noise TV. They're out of Germany. They have a song called Work One No. I'm sorry, Work One Two One, and as a digital single, it's brand new. It's on self released. Uh, White Noise TV has um, was kind enough to send this single over as well. They did mention that it's like a play on uh, Front 242's track, uh, Work. I forget what the, you know, it's but, but Verk. it's Verk, yeah. like Verk's fly. Yep. So pretty cool. Uh, good stuff. Um, yeah. And I've always enjoyed it. And they, um, they're a great band. If you haven't heard White Noise TV, definitely go check out their music. It's all on Bandcamp. We like band camp. Mm -hmm. We're campy like that. And the fourth track in Paradise is set was by Icecraft out of France. And that's the song Hit Your Body. And that's on the album Access Denied that came out on KL Dark Records. Good stuff. If you like uh, hard, uh, darker electro, this fantastic new album that I just. Uh, started listening to and i definitely highly recommend it right and the third track in paradise to set was unity one also out of russia with the song accelerate love unity one um this is a new digital single that you can get on sky code yeah definitely if you like unity one you're not going to be disappointed with this track good stuff always put out quality music Good future pop synth pop music there from Unity One. Well produced. Yes, definitely. Good stuff. Um, the second track in my set was by State of the Union, who is just here in Tampa. Fantastic band. Um, they have a brand new, well, they've had this single out called Purgatory, but they have a brand new mix out now of Purgatory. It's available. Uh, it's a dance mix of it. It's a digital single. You can pick it up through their band camp. Uh, fantastic song. I'm looking forward to more State of the Union, but man, I'm just so happy that they actually came to Tampa and played a show. Uh, they're fan, just great band. Great I'm band. super happy that I finally got to see State of the Union because it yes. brought me back to the early 2000s, and um, I've never seen them before. Because but uh, the first track was a brand new release by Simon Carter featuring Rune Conflict. They combined 
their talents. It's a fantastic song. Oh, I said fantastic again. And <laughs> The song you've is already called, uh, since you've been talking, you've already said it three times. No, no, no you can't. Don't, don't hope, give the I count. I hope people are doing shots at home. Yeah, let people um, guess. Every time. And uh, the song you heard was "Let Music Live Forever." That is on. A, that's a digital single that Simon Carr just released. And uh, go pick it up. Uh, I would say um, again, I love um, Rune Conflict. I love uh, his voice and. Um, Simon Carter, you know, with his music behind it, it just made this even that much better. So, Does good Simon stuff. Carter sing at all? No, Simon's not singing. He's eating his tea and crumpets. Except for that one song. Where drinking he's like, his tea Simon! and his crumpets. Yeah. And yeah, now he's doing his. Uh, he's eating, his, drinking his tea and eating his crumpets and scones and scones. Yep. And and figgy pudding. Oh yes. Can't forget the figgy pudding. Mm-hmm. So, there you go. Blood Good pudding. stuff. I hope you enjoyed my set. A large amount of new music that came out, um, and you know, very dancey set. I I thought that was my whole goal. Try and get your butt moving. So I hope and you're dancing that it's in your time. seat. Yeah. Hey, we have a we have a we have a game now because I say fantastic so many times <laughs> without even knowing it. If you if you hear me say it, you're supposed to be doing a shot at home. He'll be really yeah. drunk by the time the show is over with. Only play that game idea. on Fridays and Saturdays or like when you're not working. <laughs> yeah, don't yeah, do, oh, do, that, do it at work. That would even be better. And if you do it at work, <laughs> please send us a video. <laughs> we would love to see that. That'd be hilarious. No, no, no. no it really <laughs> wouldn't. It wouldn't be. <laughs> I highly don't recommend that. But it would still be funny. It would be fun. Oh, and by the way, I was I was advised. Um, well, we'll we'll get to that afterwards. I'm going to read our donations for the week. Uh, um, and I want to thank everybody again who continues to donate to the podcast. If you want to help us uh, continue running our show, all you have to do is go to comeafterdark.com and there's a donate option on there. You can become a one-time donor kebab or a single donor kebab. Oh no, that's right. One time and single are the same. Duh. I mean, a monthly donor kebab. <laughs> Ding, or ding, one ding, time ding. donor kebab. Uh, duh. Anyways, fantastic. all right. Fantastic. Yeah, exactly. That was fantastic. Um, <laughs> donations this week are from Paul Crouch, uh, Jan Rolf Zimmerman, Stephanie Roper, Terrific Trades, uh, Marcy Rubin, uh, David Montoya, Thorsten Sendler, Elizabeth Plastino, Autumn Webster, Max Cole, uh, Mike Paulneski. The Dark Lord of Serpents, uh, Jorge Marquin, Bo Brian, Chris Cantlin, Eric Fritzler, Ruben Carter, uh, Charlie Baker out of Georgia. And is a good, he works at Augusta Tattoo Club. I believe it's his own tattoo place, if I'm not mistaken. Um, Mr. Uh, Mr. Saturday Night Fever, <laughs> uh, Alexander Uphoff, James Weikertz. Original Art, John Cuff, Stephen Urquieta, Cat Lee, Pamela Gelino of Alaska, one of our two Alaska listeners, um, Dominic Witsack, Marcus Kunenstein, David Kreshner, Luis Garcia Rivera, Aaron Wallach, uh, Alan Huddleston, Will Fries, David Munoz, Christopher Clark, Tobias Sargent, uh, Joel Gonzalez, who's out of the uh, Tampa area, Shelly Wiley, who runs Ravens and Rockers with her daughter, Shelly uh, Wiley and Shelly Wiley, Shelly Wiley and Sheena Wiley, who own Ravens and Rockers, and they run the Ravens and Rockers. Fantastic people. Go say hi to them if you're in town. They have the best clothing around. Uh, Seven Snort, who's also out of Tampa. Uh, John Dillinger, Joseph Fair, Ben B, Sven Wolston, uh, Sven, 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 Sven W, uh, Jan, Jan, I'm not going to butcher your name. <laughs> that's, to be, that's Jan's name. I apologize, Jan, you're, you're fantastic. Uh, oh, I said, oh my God, I said it again. Catherine, you need to do another shot at home. Catherine Bowles, uh, Jill P, Anders Arstrand. 
uh, Neil McCombie, Daniel Weiss, Daniel Sarwine out of Kansas, Roland P, Eleanor D, uh, Mark, Mark, uh, Maria Brodine, and I think that might be everybody. I'm not sure. Let me check. All right. Thank you to everybody again who donated to the podcast. You, you're all amazing. I'm going to say amazing. This time, people are probably drunk now if they've been doing our game. Listen to how many times I say yeah, fantastic. Like, I just said it again. Oh, I said it again. Keep drinking. <laughs> Keep drinking. I hope our Thank buddies you, from uh, still listen to us. Uh, what was what was their names? Get Drink Your Drink? Drink Hartmut, Your Drink. Hartmut and um, Michael. Uh, they were out of... Uh, Man, I can't remember. Chemnitz. They live in Chemnitz? They live in Chemnitz? Yeah, yeah. And yeah. is it Yvonne? Yvonne, yeah. Yeah, I haven't heard from them in so long. Man, it's been a long time. They were fantastic. Oh, my God. So you got to drink again? <laughs> I love that. I love that word. Mona M. Pollution, I got to meet a longtime listener, Susan. Yeah. Oh, you know oh, what? Yeah, Susan. Susan. So that was Susan nice. was yeah. there. That's right. Oh. Yes, I really wish I had had more of a chance to speak to Susan Absolution. We met a few of our our listeners at Absolution. Yeah, I met Susan, met Methosian uh, from Denver. Mm -hmm. I met James Trimarco, who I never, I don't think I ever met him before. uh, He's from St. Pete, so he's local. But yeah, it was pretty pretty awesome. And then I finally met Brian of Blacklight. Um, He wrote me and said we totally failed to get a picture together. And yeah. we did. I failed we a totally lot of did. people. <laughs> oh, well. It was a good time. But I'm not one though. to, like, go out of my way to, like, get a picture, I think, with someone. I'm a weird person. I forget to take pictures completely. Yeah. The only picture I got was with Vasi. <laughs> well, you remember that one. Yeah. All right. I didn't all right, even get the... a picture with Vasi, and we all went and had Indian food together. Like, I didn't... A picture yeah. with Vasi. It's going on my wall. I'm going to blow it up really big. And frame That's it. That's awesome. That's awesome. All right. We're going to, I'm going to, oh, we're, I'm going to finish off with my last song, which is by a band that played Absolution and was one of the highlights of this year. Empathy Test out of the UK. I'm playing one of their older tracks called Bear My Soul. It's a fantastic song. It's like poetry put to music. So go listen. It's a single that I'm playing this off of. I have the uh, single at home. But um, I'm sure this song was on uh, some of the CDs he released as well. So good stuff. And um, come back for some comments from our listeners. Something that's not so deep and meaningful But the truth can be so tragic and beautiful
disappear A face reflected in the review Welcome back to Kimmy After Dark. I hope you enjoyed the empty test track. And I have some comments here I wanted to read um, from our listeners. This is from YouTube. Army Goth said, Mad props to the Mad Professor. He was on last week, and he did a great job. He said, if I were at the clubs, his set would have had me leaving the dance floor in a sweaty mess from dancing so much. Good job, Mad Professor. Mm -hmm. uh, much love. Uh, we um, also got a comment from Metal Yoga with Steph. Metal yeah. Yoga with That's awesome. Yeah, she has a channel where she does rock and roll workout. That's awesome. Like fit, like yoga fitness to metal. That's cool. What is, That's what is very cool. Doing right now? Can you, I, I'm trying to, to adjust my volume. I apologize. All right, anyways, the comment from Metal Yoga with Steph said, One of my favorite episodes in a while, I could instantly tell one of the remixes was Aesthetic Perfection. Done. Ha ha, great mix. Yeah. Okay, and we got a comment from Nebel Velton, who says, My favorites from this week's show, Signosic, Hold My Faith, Beyond Border, Radiant. Uh, Freaky Mind, Downs and Downs, the Iskin Mix, and Darkness on Demand, Last Attack. Thank you, Nibble. Thank and you. then uh, one from Joel Herring, 6090, who says, I'm a few episodes behind, but when the Mad Professor was on last, you guys calling out for other scientists who listen to CAD. I'm an organic and analytical chemist working in the oil and gas industry in Gladstone, Australia. I've been listening for 11 years now and have found so many new bands I love thanks to you guys. Cheers, CAD crew, Joel. Thank yeah, you know, Joel. we, we, yeah, Joel's cool. We, we received comments from him in the past. And, um, we received a handful of comments this past week on YouTube from Australian listeners. So mm -hmm. we're getting some, we're, we're gaining some ground in Australia. That's pretty cool. Pretty cool. That's a big place. Did we ever figure out? Did the mad professor ever get back with you? Maybe, maybe Mouse knows. Hmm? Australia, what what country is it, right? It's on Oceanic or? Uh, uh, the, the no, it's a continent. Is, continent. The continent. The is Australia, continent. but it's an Asian continent. Yeah. See, Mouse knows. Like that was a big, that was a discussion last week and Lance was mm -hmm. supposed to come back with an answer. Oh, was he gonna like venture out and discover it? On yeah, where is, where is the map professor with his answers? Anyways. Maybe he went to Australia yeah. to get the answer. Yeah, <laughs> yeah exactly. Right, go ahead, and, Miles. Uh, Miles read those 
Uh, Kaiju Johnny said, looks like YouTube ate my comment from last week's show. Hoping DJ Gold has a speedy recovery. My favorites from this week were Signostic, Alien Vampires, Nora Makina, Circuit Preacher, Alice, Circle of Dust, Darkness on Demand, Red Meat, Soft Bane, and Christian Death. Cheers, Cat. Yeah. You liked uh, Matt, Pro- Matt Professor said a large amount, which is cool. Mm-hmm. And then Creatures from Elsewhere, which is a friend of ours that records most of the local shows here in Florida. Um, from Wikipedia, chaps are buckled on or over trousers with mm-hmm. the chaps integrated belt. But unlike trousers, they have no seat. The term assless chaps is a pathology <laughs> and are not <laughs> joined at the crotch. No idea what that means. I feel like that yeah, can no only idea. come from Lawrence. Yeah. Yeah, it's like assless chaps, it's a it's a double negative. Like it's uh, you don't need to say it. Because you don't, chaps you don't. is already chaps chaps are, yeah, are, yeah, they're always up. Yeah, they are. They're always assless. So you're just yeah. it's like redundant. Yeah. Yep. Pretty they're, a sex, they're a sex they're thing. Redundant. And then I think somebody else <laughs> made a comment about uh they wanted to know where we got the opener for last week's show. And I'll just say um Gold is sending me all the samples. Uh, that was from Gold, and that was an actual Wicca How that right. you can go on Wikipedia and Wicca How How to Hold a Fart, and it's actually there. Mm. Oh my God. Well, I wanted to mention as well, David Munoz commented, and David Munoz, because I, I, I was talking last week about how I played the, uh, bun tr- the butt trumpet, and David Munoz told me, he said, Fun fact, uh, when Mark mentioned butt trumpet, did you know they were a band from. Here in Los Angeles, I did not. Nope, Butt David Trump. had no clue there was a band called Butt Trumpet. But I promise you, I'm going to find their music and check them out. And I'm thinking, what would their logo be on their shirt? I don't know. And, and, I have and, to look them up right now. <laughs> and David said they have a song called "You're Ugly Because You're Ugly." Oh my god, <laughs> that sounds like something Gemma would say. <laughs> oh my god, Butt Trumpet. All right. Gotta check out Butt Trumpet. There is a band called Bub. Oh my god, these album covers. <laughs> oh, okay. Is so it they're a there. With the trumpet coming out? Like, that's what I'm picturing. Yes, I'm not even guy, looking. I'm just guy, like, at the like butt at his trumpet. legs are like I'm wide guessing. open. He's sticking a butt in his asshole. Oh, I mean, wow. a trumpet in his butt. Graphic. That one time at band camp. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> All right. I guess we're done. Thanks, Mouse, again. And uh, Emma's coming on next week electronic body memes that'll be fun mm-hmm. tell her about butt trumpet i i'll mention to emma i don't know if emma's gonna find that funny though <laughs> she's very oh. funny her memes are really funny yeah she might get a kick out of that that's true she very well may get a very yeah because that's true her her memes are pretty fun we, you so. should just like like put some of her memes up to the camera because they're just so good they're so funny all right, Miles. So, well, well, Tom's gone, guys, and Tom's recovering amazingly. Uh, mm-hmm. He just went yep. to uh, Depeche Mode with yep. Paradise, and he also went to State of the Union. Um, yep. But he'll be back in a few weeks, and he's been doing his samples. So, yeah, pretty <laughs> fun. All right, Winters, Mouse, we will see you soon again. Uh, that's it, I guess. Bye, everybody. Bye. Have an amazing week. The second song on my album, or in my album. (laughs) You're making an album now. (laughs) It's a tequila, man. See, it's like, I'm such a lightweight, you guys. Okay. Will someone turn off that music? That's enough. I'm putting an end to this freak show right now. (laughs) (laughs) Ha, 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 ha,